Good evening, I'm Brian Levitan. Sir Richard Branson and Al Gore are putting up $25 million for a new science and technology prize. The Virgin Earth Project will award the money to an individual or group who can demonstrate a commercially viable design that results in the net removal of waste. The removal must have long-term effects and must contribute to the stability of the Earth's climate. An Ellensburg man thinks he's found a way to win that prize. KDO's Connor Powell spent the day with him, and he joins us now live in the studio with more. Connor. Well, Brian, every day, tons of styrofoam like this is thrown away. Engineers and scientists know that concrete and styrofoam, when mixed, form a strong, lightweight material. But no one has ever tried a mass program of collecting and recycling styrofoam to feed that mixture. That is until now. <laughs> it ain't gonna break. Yeah. The reason it won't break is because it's concrete it's mixed with styrofoam and it could revolutionize building and recycling. For several months, Rance DeWitt has put recycling bins around Ellensburg, collecting styrofoam from students and businesses and chopping it up. Mixing it with concrete and then turning it into blocks. It'll last a thousand years in landfill. And so if you uh, put it into a cement mix, you have a material that will really last forever. It's DeWitt and his research team are competing for $25 million in the Virgin Earth Challenge. The goal is to turn a waste product like styrofoam into a commercially viable product. The thermal cement blocks can be made as strong as regular cinder blocks and are waterproof, a great insulator, and fire retardant. And it could save an enormous amount in energy costs and reduce waste in landfills. Well, I call, I call this white gold. DeWitt hopes to expand his white gold recycling program to all of Washington and then across the country. Engineers told DeWitt to keep his research a secret but he told, but he, uh, so he could file for patents. But DeWitt told me that it's not, he's not in it for the money. He just cares about reducing waste and helping the environment. We have uh, all of the recycling locations on our website at candio.com. In the studio, I'm Connor Powell, Candio Local News.